Hello and welcome back to some more of Dwarf Fortress with me, the Green Dragon. We are in uh, Fireclaw, as you well know by now. And, uh, well, we are building shit like there's no tomorrow. For example, the volcano thing. Oh yes, we are building things. Also, Fireclaw, well, our little uh, mascot is still there as well. And overall, things seem good. Copper stocks are gradually dwindling as we are making our insane amounts of armor for, you know, emergencies, if we ever need more heavy infantry. And here, well... Here you can uh, guess what's gonna happen. Or we'll be able to soon. If someone with a named tomb loses limb, do they bury the limb right away or wait until the dwarf dies? I think they wait until the dwarf dies. I think they wait. But I'm not entirely sure, so I couldn't really say. I could use steel, but gold is the metal of the volcano god, because it's so warm and shiny, like magma. No, cast damage. Show me this level. I want to see my gem mine. Okay, looks like we've found a few more gems. So we should extract those, of course. Even some black zircons. Hello. Oh, this isn't bad at all up here. Apparently, Rylite levels have something to offer. Sweet. That will do, pig. That will do. Well, while we're working on that, we could dig around the volcano yay, here in order to, you know, set boundaries. Yay, so. And then we can... Um, Sink exploratory shafts. I don't want to chop down trees, Jesus. In like this, to make sure we get all the gems around it. But without actually digging into it, because that would be offensive. And we wouldn't want to offend our patron deity now, would we? Okay. And just really accurately explore around the actual uh, magma pipe. Just delicate like, you know? Well, that's off sync. But this ought to do. There we go. Yeah, that should be good. Should be good. Oh, yes. Gems, gems, gems. Mm-hmm. How are the actual gem dudes doing, though? How are their skills? I mean, they're still kind of crap, because they've mostly been cutting granite to clear this place out. But, on a side note, this place is relatively cleared out. Not too much granite trash around anymore. Little bit here, but it's going away. And that is a shroom growing in my thing. That is just a oud. No, why, why basalt? Why are you downstairs? No, I, I don't want that. There, do it like that. Jeez, get good. Okay, you're ripping that open, that's fine. Then we have the Golden Bridge of Doom. I might actually need to rip all this open to make it... Yeah. 
That's actually probably the best idea. Just need to watch this to make sure they don't fuck up too badly. Hopefully. Because, yeah, they'll have a nasty tendency to walk over things as they're being <laughs> ripped up. And then it's like, ah, and sploosh, and then there's sadness. Random copper bolts all over the map as well. Eek. That's not exactly good. Alright. This is sealed up. That's perfect. We don't really want anything here. Oh, that's part of where the granite is. Oh, that's fine. Less granite to worry about. What about you here? How are you doing overall? Well, you found some more gems. That's good. Yeah, there's a bunch of carrying to be done. Lots of gems to be brought out, but that's okay. We'll we'll manage. We'll make it work. All right. It looks like this is actually pretty profitable. Like, I could reopen some of these levels later and just smooth and engrave them. Looks like someone's done some work here. I mean, that's good. Uh, I might need to... Ooh, we need more soap bars, apparently. But I might need to dig out some more copper soon. I have a feeling we are not exactly... I mean, we still have a good stockpile, a couple, like, hundred and change units. But it's no longer full the whole time, you know? So at some point we are gonna have to dig out more. Because holy crap was this a big order for copper stuff, so... People are gonna feel that. And this just looks fugly, by the way. I'm debating what to do with it. I could make some random stockpiles here, but what would I even store there? It's hard to say. I think I have stockpiles for virtually everything that I really need, so... Okay, they managed not to fall in ripping up these. That's extremely positive, especially as they did it while I wasn't looking. Which is always, always a disturbing thought. I could actually make some gold doors here. Yeah, make the whole room enclosed. Is the bridge too big? I don't think it is. I think it's fine the way it is. And honestly, if it fails to throw people in, you can always try again. Or fails to throw cats in. And you can always try again and again and again. That, that's not really a problem, is it? Yeah, definitely could use more hauling manpower. Mostly because we're doing so many projects at the same time. You know what, that's enough Kimberlet. We should stop digging all the things from these levels. Or from the cavern, because the cavern is kind of crap. We should close it off, honestly, there's not much point to it. Mostly, you know, as a matter of, yeah, not really gaining anything out of it, and... There we go. We could use more blocks, though. So why don't we unsuspend this part of it, at least? Okay, and you're just doing that, that's fine. And then there's andesite on top of that. Quite a bit of it, I expect. Even some cobaltite. But you're mostly cutting the gems we already brought out of the gem mine, so it's gonna be a while before you can finish with the granite and everything. Which is probably something we can live with, honestly. This feels like a relatively valuable 
uh, effort actually, because we are getting a lot of gems out of it that we can further, you know, encrust into things. Hmm. I actually have an idea. Or ideas for raising the value of this fort even further. I mean, there's always the old standby of mass-produced goblets. And we could certainly dig out enough gold to make that a very, very reasonable uh, thing to do. How about we actually um, work our way through this. Just to wrap up this part, right? Like, work our way through the gem mine and then worry about the rest. And then we can see... How about we don't dig into the actual magma? There we go. But yeah, I'm gonna finish digging through this level and then we'll uh, think about what we want to do with all the gems, because we could just, like I said, take a metric fuckton of gold goblets and uh, just start encrusting for all we're worth. With the best gems, just... Um, yeah, we'll, we'll need to train up our jewelers first of all, and then we could make some super goblets. You know, encrusted with emeralds, every gem we can find, masterful, that kind of thing. That could be pretty good. Could work. Could, could be good. It's probably worth trying, actually. Why not? I mean, at this point, we have the necessities. It's more a matter of, you know, like... What the fuck do you want? Because we have most things, it's just a matter of value, really. Or cool shit we choose to try. Are there any other animals on here? Oh, look, a blood. And we have a ghostly stone crafter. A ghostly stone crafter. Did someone manage to. Must be an older one. Okay, apparently we weren't able to recover a body for burial. That sometimes happens. Oh. Fuck! Blocks, bricks, cloth, thread. Oh, oh motherfucker. What do you already have in there? You have blocks, you have logs. Oh, and we don't have thread because... Oh, because... Unsuspend, try now. Yeah, we don't have any pigtails currently. Ooh. We have stuff like blackberries growing wild, lettuces, raspberries, but we don't have rope reeds and the like. And we don't really get humans visiting either, I think. We just get dwarves. Oh. So we... Oh, that's not good. That's really ungood, isn't it? Hide root. Oh, and it's still planted with sweet pods because it's still summer. Those are pigtails, though. But we can't get in there. Okay, the cavern. This is where we can try this. This might save him. Okay, what do you want? Never could have guessed. Never could have guessed. You want more bucklers. Who the thunk? Speaking of which, how are their armoring skills? Getting good? 
pretty good, yes. And they are both legendary furniture makers, so that's good. Okay. This looks good. Oh, this looks kind of crap, actually. Let's make this slightly differently. Let's extend the... Right, I can't anchor it like that. Okay. Let's see. Gold, 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 gold. Ooh. I need five, though, so I can't. Okay. You know what? We'll leave this open. We won't make a door thing to the sacrificial chamber. This is gonna be like a big blue cave with the glow of magma inside. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's how we're gonna do it. Okay, and hopefully we can uh, harvest some pigtails from here, because if we can't, we're gonna lose our boyer. Oh, that's unfortunate. It's really unfortunate. These are just turquoise. These are essentially valueless for us. But we're still gonna dig them, of course, because we're gonna strip this whole freaking level of everything of value. Obviously. Oh, look, gems. All right. Good, good, good. Excellent. Okay. Yeah. Apparently, we are not producing enough big tails for our consumption. Which is why a single field that produces at least a little bit all year round which would have to be an outdoor field due to how the game works, would be better, except we don't have outdoor plants, seeds of the right kind. Which leaves us madly fuck. But we'll see if we can request some from the next year's traders. Or this year's traders. And maybe that they'll be able to bring us either the right kind of plants or right kind of seeds. Maybe, like hemp or rope reeds. Either or, something, something that can be spun into cloth. Cause, yeah. Apparently our dwarves go through clothing fast. There we go. That's been ordered and that's gonna take quite a while cause, you know, like, everyone's a miner. Oh well, it'll have to do. I mean, there's not that much mining, it's just cleaning out one level, right? I wonder if we could flood this as we leave. And I was talking about this fucker and I completely sidetracked myself somehow, didn't I? Oh my god. Engrave him a slab, jeez. Down here, you are gathering all the things, including rope reeds. Good. Good. And this is like a seed stockpile, right? Looks like it is. Alright, good. This needs architecture, but the actual people who could make it are gonna be busy for a long time anyway. Well, not that long, actually. We still have the axes to make, but it's 
it's like 80 items, that's not an insane amount, it's a workable amount. What are we dealing with here? More turquoise, I mean that's kind of crap. I'd like more Levin Opals, please. Spusser teams will do. Hello, precious. Oh yes, that's good. And apparently we are switching over to summertime. Which means we're gonna be starting to plant our own uh, pigtails. I need to maintain a bigger stockpile of ready-made cloth, I think. Just maintain a bigger stockpile so we have the reserves we need, because clearly we didn't when we started dumping the old clothing. Clearly we didn't. So, up above here. Um, let's go 320 to 400. Yeah, let's go nuts on it. Let's get a real supply. Right, and that's barley. That's essentially eatable. Just kind of meh. But what you're gonna do... Elite Marksman or Marks Dwarf. T that will do. That will do quite nicely, I believe. This will need roof, of course. Can't cause constructions in the way, right? Right. Rip up this style. And we're gonna make a... Um, Cunning thing here. Actually, no, I don't even need to do that. Depending on how I choose to do this. I could just make a platform around this. Which I was planning on doing anyway. And I'll connect it there from that corner and that would work. And you're coming to get gold or kimberlite or both. Good, good, good. Good. And what pray tell is going on here? Ah, uh, no. I don't believe you did. You are an elite Marks Dwarf now. Congratulations, Ratnak. You still live. We are making a sacrificial pit, though. We are so making sacrificial pit now. We're gonna start with kittens and see if that satisfies the volcano god. Hmm. Yep, that's building. Good, good, good. Well, I'll forbid that so it can be gathered at least. Don't leave it like that. <laughs> okay. Gemmine looks good. That is... Well... You won't melee a goblin with your crossbow because A, we don't get uh, goblin raids apparently because they're not our neighbors. I think. Yeah, just the mirror of heart, that's our only neighbor. So no goblin raids. And also, uh, well, you have a uh, short sword. No, I think that was a different dwarf. Uh, the ghost, I think, was from before, even. But, well... 
accumulate memorial to that dumbass. I should actually place it. Wait, what? Troglodytes? I'm sure your sword is perfectly average sized. All those rumors must be just wild slander ratneck. Perfectly average, I'm sure. It's not like the whole fortress knows. I mean, really. So yeah, looks like everyone's gonna be busy with this, which is fine. There's a lot of... lot of little worthless gems, which we'll take all the same, because we like gems so much. Just gonna extract everything from here. <laughs> I mean, that's how we know the rumors are accurate. Because, you know, <laughs> you did get around. <laughs> that's why everyone knows Ratnak. Alrighty. And as to here. What do we want to do? I think we want to continue with this, actually. Making a walkway slash parapet slash whatever around here. I do believe it, Ratnak. I'm pretty damn sure the rumors are, in fact, accurate. I do, in fact, believe it. All right. Right, you're just the one that's fucked up permanently by scarring. That's fine, that happens, that's normal. I mean, if you go in the hospital, you're not coming out intact. We know who our doctor is, and he's not very good. Okay. Yeah, yeah, this, this is gonna take a while still. There's still some digging to do. Who oh boy. All of the digging. And you are doing that. Oh, please tell me you're spinning some bloody cloth already. Do it now. These are important jobs, get to them. If there are any pigtails anywhere, and there are, they need to be spun into thread because we have an artifact moron who's gonna go nuts. I'm just saying. How's the booze? How's the booze situation overall? Good, excellent. This seems mildly boring. I wonder if I could add something fun to that. <laughs> okay, good. Spin it into something useful. That hopefully the bloody dude below can get and use. Come on, just, just pick it apart and spin it into thread or something. <laughs> Come on! That's thread. He should be rushing up, up up here to get it, right? Did he move? No. Ooh. Mm, let us 
skin, we should have leather, blocks, bricks, we have that cloth thread. We we have pigtail thread. Is it getting carried first? No, 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 don't die it. Jesus. It's really not good enough for you. Oh, that, that's... Oh, fuck. Godzilla. Oh, you're not here at the moment, I think, but... I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. A salute to you, oh brave warrior. We're gonna put some people here to put you down. Because... RIP. I... I, I don't think we can. I don't think there are webs here. I, I honestly don't think we can. And on that sad note, thank you everyone for watching. I hope you enjoyed this and I'll see you guys in the next episode.